All right. Uh, I think that's USP ammo, so not very useful to us. Is there a rash? No? Man. Oh, well. I think we'll be fine. She's actually much more annoying to fight on uh, European Extreme. I will show you guys when we get to that, but on normal, it's not bad. Control room, communications, and engine room are under control. All entry and exit points to the tanker hold secured. Infrared sensors placed and operational. Good work. Are the explosives in place? Yes, they are all planted. Listen, once we have what we came for, the tanker will be scuttled. And the vehicle's pilot? He's the only one who underwent the VR training. No one else can do it. Are you sure you can trust him? Your part in the mission is complete. You are to leave at once. No, it's not over yet. I can see the moon, even in this storm, pale as death. I have a bad feeling about this mission. You swore this to me, that you would leave the unit once the mission was complete. Do not worry, this is a country of liberty. No, this is where I belong, with the unit. I have nowhere else to go. Father, I want to stay and fight. There is no choice to make here, Olga. Need I remind you that you are carrying my grandchild? You will be on the helicopter out of here now. Damn it. I will not. Get the fuck out of here. Don't worry, baby. I'll take care of you. Freeze. He's got them hairy pits, though. Hands over your head. Now. I love how much fucking detail they put into that for like no reason. Gun overboard. Slowly. Snake didn't have hairy pits in MGS1. Remember? We saw it in Twin Snakes. A woman. Show your face. You men, you're all the same. Who are you? We are nomads. Wanderers. I said to move. Americans. So you ship women too. I'm a nomad. Oh boy. What else do you have there? Take the knife and toss it. Not there. Toss it overboard. Hold that position. Now, turn around. You know what you're doing. <laughs> Not a good idea to make fun of me. I got the Beretta here. It stopped me. Not too shabby, is it? New York, I mean. Pretty shitty shot. And that brings our tour to its conclusion. Scout knife with a surprise. You a Spetsnaz? I think you deserve a little credit. No one's ever dodged that shot of mine. But no one gets lucky twice either. I'll be sure and remember that, bitch. All right, so we gotta fucking fight Harry Pitts. Wait till she uh, runs behind that thing over there. Fuck. Been with the unit since I was born. I grew up on the battlefield. Conflict and victory were my parents. The razor is my enemy. Is my life, my family. We've shared everything. Ah! All, all, all right, so she thinks I'm over there now. Or wait, the no, she doesn't. Nothing else matters to me. Okay, cool. Can you fucking move? Ugh. Whoever you are, you're not stopping us. You can just hold L1 and auto aim. Ah. You bitch. All right, fuck. Pain in my ass. 
Uh, once you hit her a couple times, she's gonna like shoot the tarp and then shoot the light and shit. Alright. Alright. Peck. Hector. Jesus fucking Christ. I was gonna say Pector. That would have been fucked up. Alright, she's eventually gonna just run forward. You can't hit her there. The only way you can is from uh, over there. You bitch! Fuck, I'm bad. How the? I think I got her. On European Extreme, I'd be dead already. Nice, nice cartwheel. Dumbass. Dumbass! Fuck. I'm just gonna start doing auto aiming. Yeah, see, it's easy as fuck. I just thought I'd do some first person shit to be fancy. I think on uh, European Extreme they disabled the uh, auto aiming. How the fuck can she see through that? She was getting ready to throw a grenade. Ow. Wall. There we go. And right after that, she would shoot the fucking light, but I already disabled it. Uh, if we hit her in the head, it does more uh, non-lethal damage, but unfortunately, I can't seem to fucking hit her head to save my life, so... You just hit her with an auto shot. It's fine. We're done with the boss fight. Woo! I would have been dead immediately on European Extreme. She does way more damage. You could take like a thousand hits on normal, so it doesn't matter. I'm still kind of rusty. Give me a minute. I'll get better as I keep playing. Finally. I hate those fucking things. Fucking hate ciphers so much. Otacon, the ship appears to be under their control. The men have Russian gear, but I haven't been able to find out anything else about their origin. Russia. We do. We've ID'd the old man. Who is he? Sergei Gerlukovich. Gerlukovich, one of Ocelot's allies. Yeah, the Gru Colonel. He's the one Ocelot was supposed to meet up with after Shadow Moses. They're after Metal Gear. Uh, this is not going to be as simple as we thought. You could say that. I saw a surveillance remote just now. It looked like the Cypher. A Marine Cypher T? No, Army. First the Marines, then the Russians, now the Army? You're right. This isn't going to be simple. Snake, there's something I have to tell you. What? what? We didn't dig up this info about the new Metal Gear on our own. Not like usual. How did you find out then? It was a tip. An anonymous tip. Anonymous? You've never trusted those. Why would you start now? I, uh... I have a younger sister. A stepsister. We have different parents. I only knew her for two years. You've never mentioned her before. So? The sender of the tip was E.E. E.E.? -E? E -E? Her name is Emma, but I always call her E.E. -E. Emma? Emmerich? Yeah. It just caught my eye, you know. I, I figured it was a coincidence, but I couldn't get it out of my mind. 
there's really no one out there who knows about her. When was the last time you saw her? Over ten years ago. Damn. You think it's a trap to lure us out here? I don't know. After I got the tip, I did break into the Pentagon system to get confirmation. Okay. Watch your back, Snake. Maybe I screwed up. I've got a light-equipped USP. I can take them on now. There's no ammo, but it takes a 9mm, just like the Marine's M9. I'll find those somewhere around here. Don't raise too much racket with that thing. I hear you. Um, there is a suppressor for it. Um, I don't remember where the fuck it's at in substance. Actually, I don't even think it was in Sons of Liberty now that I think about it. I think you could only get the suppressor on uh, subsistence. Subsistence. I fucking hate that name. I always said substance, but that's wrong. All right, we're going to go up here and we're going to grab... Uh... Fuck, I think there's thermal goggles up here. Uh, but the suppressor for the uh, USP is also up here on one of the difficulties. So, I think you can only get it in, like, a New Game Plus playthrough, so I don't believe we can actually get it on the first playthrough. It'd be busted as fuck, like, it'd make the tanker way too easy. It's my damn phone, sorry. I'm getting messages on Facebook. That's why I hate Facebook. Alright, so some idiot's gonna come out of the fucking door over here. We're just gonna drop his ass. All right, knock him out. There's a wet box over here. We don't need it. I'm just picking it up. It's pretty fucking useless. Okay. All right, head inside. There's some USP ammo just right above us when we get in the door here. But like Otacon said, don't use this thing around people. It'll automatically alert people to your presence. We're going to head back down. Uh, but you can use this to destroy cameras and, uh... Okay. Alright, so we're gonna crawl in here. Um, there's nothing in... Oh, What's that? nothing. Okay, so we're just gonna fuck off out of here. Let this guy walk to the end of the hall. Drop him. And then you can take your USP. Pop it. Just make sure that you knock the guy out first, otherwise you're fucked. Uh, don't knock him out under camera, it'll alert people. Knock this fucker, well, kill his ass. We ain't knocking anybody out. We're over that. Alright, there's gonna be a guy coming. Knock him out. There's only uh, two guys in this area. There's him, and then there's this one guy down here who smells like shit. Uh, fuck it. Uh, but if you touch him, the flies, like, stick to you for some fucking reason. Probably because you got his stank on you. Uh, there's some USP ammo down there. I'm not gonna fucking shoot these guys in the head while they're sleeping. They We're not gonna be in here nearly long enough for it to matter. Uh, but there's a naked lady. Oh, well. In the PS2 version, there's a Japanese lady in a bikini there. Ugh. So you can pull out your digital camera and take some pictures, if you want. We're not going to do that. We're going to come in here. Raven? Raven? Freeze. Oh. 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 All right, you can drag him in here. Oh, 
Uh oh. Okay, well, you are definitely dead now. Like. We need to hurry up. Drag this guy in here. Because I fucked up. Oh, fuck. Uh. Alright, back up against this. Hit triangle. I want my damn ammo. Can't believe I fucked that up. I'm so annoyed. Uh, but shoot Raven. Everything else is normal. There's just a fucking Vulcan Raven thing shooting pellets everywhere. Yeah, I had to wait and wait for them to fuck off. I fucking love that reference, by the way. That's great. You know what? Fuck it. I ain't in the mood. Okay. There's another guy down here. Can actually poke him. Okay, hold. He'll get fucked off. Knock him out. Yeah, there's a couple guys in this room that you need to worry about, but I'll take care of them. Uh, if you want their dog tags, you know how to do it. Like I said, um, I'm going to make a dog tag video at some point going over how to get them all, so stay tuned for that if that's something you'd be interested in. There's a fucking, there's a poster of a girl all the way out there. You can kind of see it, but we're not fucking around with that shit. There's a guy down there. Knock him out. You don't have to, but... If in the event that you get caught, less guys that come after you is better, so... Alright, run in here. You can't go down that way, so just run up here. Repair of the entrance way to the engine room on the port side is complete. We'll return to position following patrol of the small room on the port side. Knock him out. And then we got a bit of uh, work to do. Now what we can do, equip the thermal goggles and you can see the, the lasers. So knock that one out. Uh, there's one right above us. We can get that in a second. Knock that one out. Uh, got them all and that's it there's also a little picture that you could take here if you want like a little easter egg thingy my bob just take a picture of that good it's just a little joke that you can uh, play on Otacon he finds it absolutely fucking hysterical, so we're going to do it, because why not? Anyway, we're also going to do another Easter egg here. Arizona Bridge checkpoint passed. All non-essential personnel report to the holds in 10... Oops. 
Uh. Then it's time for the scheduled briefing session with the Commandant. You are ordered to continue manning your posts until that time. Come in here. Now a guy will stop in front of you here. When he does, peek out. What? Don't move. You'll be fine. Just don't move. Who's there? <laughs> don't sneak up on me like that. Damn pipe. Nah, it was just my imagination playing tricks on me. Yeah, that's what it was. Anyway, there's gonna be a guy listening to like Backstreet Boys up here. We're gonna fucking knock him out. He reminds me of that guy from fucking uh, True Lies, starring Arnold Schwarzenegger. That fucking guy that's just listening to music, cleaning the apartment, and then the fucking jet just blows through the fucking window. I love that movie, by the way. Fantastic film. If you haven't seen it, you should. It's great. Getting these guys' dog tags is kind of a pain in the dick, but it's it's doable. What you can do is you can knock them out, drag them to an area, uh, wake them up, and then hold them up. It's easier to do it that way, too. That way you clear the room. Uh, hold on, was there M9 ammo back here? I'm gonna need it. Yeah. During this little mini boss fight, um, they give you ammo and shit back, so it doesn't matter, but... Yeah, we're gonna need rations for sure. Uh, we're gonna equip the USP, and here we go. <sighs> oh, that's my phone. Also under our control. Foreskin. Sir, the Marine Commander has started his speech already. We will complete the preparations before the end of the speech. All communications to the halls have been severed. No one is aware of our presence. Let no one down into the halls until we are out. Yes, sir. We will secure your exit with our lives if necessary. There is one more thing. Hold you to that. Yes, sir. This dude down here, he's just like, I know there's someone down here. I can feel it. Who goes there? How the fuck did you know I was here? Uh, there's rations behind you if you need them. If you keep them equipped, though, you'll just automatically use them. So I'm not too worried about it. Same thing goes with your ammo. If you ever run low on ammo, don't worry about it. Uh, we run back here real quick. 
See, you have everything. That's it. 